Hi, Hi fellow birdies. birdies. Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we are actually both in the car together and we're gonna be taking on our first ever 24 hour challenge together. This one has been one we've been wanting to do for a while and I know you guys have been wanting to see it too. What the person orders in front of us for 24 hours for the whole day, the people in front of us are gonna be controlling what we eat basically. We're at Dunkin' Donuts for breakfast and they are of course known for their breakfast sandwiches, coffee, and donuts. I know you're kind of nervous about this one because of the coffee. Yep, my <laughs> hope is that it's got something other than coffee. Then I can give her the coffee. Have some coffee. No. <laughs> we will be back with you guys when we get ready to order the food. And yeah, I'm kind of excited. We'd like to order what the car in front of us ordered. What the, you know, basically what the truck in front of us ordered. We like to order the same thing. I didn't understand. Are you saying you ordered the same thing the car in front of you ordered? Yep. Thank you very much, sir. Yeah, I still think some people don't know about this challenge, but like when he went to the KFC and did that solo one, mm -hmm. the guy at the drive thru window actually knew what the heck he was talking about. So you doing this for a YouTube video? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Good, Good morning. morning. I'm not because it's too small. I mean, basically, I doubt, that's, I doubt there's coffee in it. Yep. You guys have a great day. Me too. You too. Thank you. Mm -hmm. All right, so this is the order. Mm -hmm. To me, it's going to be like probably a donut or a sandwich, but let's go find out. All right, so we are now back with our order mm -hmm. and let's see what we got. We got a couple of donuts. We got some sort of chocolate covered mm -hmm. one. I think it's. And I know you like those, so I'll let you have that. So this order didn't have any drinks. So this is, I think, a cake donut. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right, if I'm wrong. So this is perfect. Cheers. Indeed. Mmm. Mm-hmm. So like just cake, you know, itself or like filling? This actually, um... I want to admit to you guys, this is actually the first time I've ever eaten a Dunkin' Donuts donut. Mm-hmm. Mm Not bad. I'm just glad for this. Mm -hmm. So big thumbs up for this first one. I am definitely mm -hmm. excited. This is a good way to have breakfast. Andy, I'm just glad that it's not it's breakfast and not like coffee. I was worried that would just be like an order of coffee. Yeah. Of course, if it had been, I would have gladly drank it. I would ask her to make the ultimate sacrifice. But this is perfect. Mm-hmm. Mm. Although I kind of wish I had like some milk or coffee to dip this into because this would be perfect. It's a little bit on the dry side, although it tastes as good. But overall, this is pretty good. What about yours? I think yours is like a Boston cream or something. I forget the name of it. You ship it, maybe it's a Boston cream. Mm -hmm. But it's got, it's got chocolate frosting. It's got ooey gooey you know, cream in the center. <laughs> it's just like one of those you know, eclairs or long johns I love so much. And I'm just perfectly happy. <laughs> <laughs> like, this is basically my ideal, you know, donut. Mm -hmm. Me too, because this was simple. Mm -hmm. I love simple donuts. Not me, I love cream filled donuts. <laughs> Although I love it too, I like the chocolate covered ones, but I'm not a big fan of the ones that are like, you know, cream filled. But mm -hmm. overall, this was a great breakfast. So we're going to be back with you guys around lunchtime mm -hmm. and we will see you then. All right, guys, we are now back in line for lunch. And mm -hmm. for lunch, we decide to do McDonald's because why not? We're both kind of craving a good, like, burger or whatever else. So we'll just see what the person in front of us orders. So we got a big truck in front of us. I will admit that, so I'm kind of a little bit optimistic. But we'll find out in just a moment. Happy Wednesday. Hello there. Happy, Happy Wednesday. Guys. We like to get what the you know, truck in front of us got. Yeah. Just, like, copy their order if you can. If the, oh, sure. sure. I'm curious what it is, but don't tell me. It's supposed to be a surprise for us. Have a blessed day. You too. Yeah. All right, we're now back with our order from McDonald's. Now we end up getting medium fries, and 
I'm gonna let you have the chicken sandwich because I know you love chicken sandwiches, so I'll eat the fries. All right. Let's see what There's I There's a lot of fries in the bag. Mmm. Mmm. I will bet they got a pretty good chicken sandwich. Mm hmm. Because uh, I tried it once before and it was pretty tasty. Mm. That's good. Well, if I had to pick my favorite fries from any place, definitely McDonald's. Although, one memory I do have is that my grandma, my grandma would always say that Crystal had the best fries. It's this um, fast food chain like White Castle Burgers. Mm -hmm. She always loved their fries. I think Papa Elmer would agree too. <laughs> mm. They're biased. Crystal's is awesome. <laughs> We're thinking since this order was so small, we might go to one more location for lunch. So, and I know we're still definitely hungry. Mm -hmm. So there's a chance we might go to Crystal after this or if not somewhere else, but mm -hmm. it kind of just depends on how much traffic's going through. Mm -hmm. Well, we're on. I'm satisfied with this one. Mm. Donuts, fries. Mm. Tasty chicken. <laughs> I like how tall bread is. Which is probably because it's crispy, but hey. We're always good with extra pickles. Mm -hmm. mm. So yeah, I could just eat these all day. Alright. An idea would be to order like two large sizes of this and make like animal style fries out of them or chili cheese fries. You just put your toppings on them. That is so good. Mm. I am 100% in agreement there. <laughs> I think I even did an animal style run as once for my channel, too. That's it? Sure. There you go. Mm. Nice and salty. Mm. They actually got um, a new spicy kind of chicken sandwich at McDonald's now. It's like a spicy deluxe. I haven't tried it yet. All right, guys, we'll be back with you probably pretty shortly because mm -hmm. we're going to go try to find something else for lunch. We're now at Taco Bell, and we're going to go ahead and do our order. Hello there. We like to get the same thing that that, uh, is it a van? I think it's a van. Seven. The van in front of us, Scott. Seven crunchy tacos, no um, cheese. Sure. All right. $12.98. Sounds good. Thank you. I kind of wish you hadn't told us what it was, <laughs> but oh well. All right, so we got our order here, mm -hmm. and it's seven crunchy tacos with no cheese. But, like, I can't have a taco without cheese, so this is going to be pretty interesting. All right, so we made sure to ask for sauces, too, so I got my mild sauce, and he got and he got the Diablo sauce. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so here you go. That's what it looks like. There's no cheese. Like, where's the cheese? And some people, I guess, just like their taco is pretty simple. Mm -hmm. and, you know, sometimes I do too, but like in this case, I want cheese on my tacos. Well, I got mine open pretty easily. Mmm. <laughs> These are not bad, but I can definitely tell it's missing a good start of the show. Now, I got Taco Bell. I don't usually go for tacos because they're pretty messy. Mm -hmm. But they're still not bad to even once in a while. The social tacos aren't bad. You know, for messiness, is the, you know, crunchy ones that are messy. Mm -hmm. and I must prefer the soft ones. Mm -hmm. So these are just, you know, filled with beef and everything except cheese. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Not bad. I'd still prefer the cheese, but I can live with that. Mm -hmm. For me, one sauce um, per taco is enough. Like with him, if he eats like a burrito or something, he's got to put the sauce on there for every single bite. Mm -hmm. There we go. 
Okay. But it's mild sauce. I can handle the hot sauce just fine, but the mild sauce is my favorite because it's this is definitely not a challenge for me to handle, you know? Gala sauce? No. <laughs> oh, heck no. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So what's your favorite that I'm going to talk about? Mine has to be the crunch wrap. I'll give you a hint. It ends with I've layer burrito. You know, they had that new beefy malt burrito that came out mm -hmm. just this past uh, week or two. And he loved it. Remember? Mm -hmm. And I was telling you, it tasted so much like your favorite. Oh, I'm now imagining a, be a five beefy layer burrito. Mm hmm. I don't think I can handle that much I'll beef. I'll tell you, those red strips mm -hmm. really make a difference. All right, guys, so we're going to go ahead and do dinner later on, and we'll be back with y'all then. That was a pretty tasty lunch, in my opinion. Hi again, guys. So we are now back out. It's getting close to dinner time, and we've decided to stop by good old KFC. I know we did do a, um, or you did a solo before of what the person in front of you ordered. Mm -hmm. Now we're going to do one together this time. <laughs> so Indeed. hopefully this order will be finger licking good. <laughs> you stole that from KFC. Yeah. How you doing today? Pretty good, pretty good. All right, what can we do for you? I want the same thing as what the car in front of me is getting. Oh, look, they had they had a they had a uh, AC meal dog, crispy. Okay. <laughs> with me now. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right. Thank <laughs> you. I think they thought that I wanted a double of what the people in front of us got. Not quite. Just think, you'll have wings sprouting from your back. Little chicken wings. And then I can fly away. <laughs> I'm not sure if I had chicken wings, I could fly away. Can they fly? I don't think they can fly. Not very well. We've got a large order. We got eight piece meal, which mm -hmm. is four legs, four thighs, large coleslaw, large fries, and four biscuits so that's a lot that is a lot my only disappointment is that it's not mashed potatoes instead of coleslaw <laughs> their coleslaw i will admit is pretty good um sometimes it could be a hit or miss but honestly i have always loved their coleslaw like when i um order from here i like getting their steak recipe fries i love their coleslaw another favorite of mine is their for me number one is <laughs> The mashed potatoes and gravy. You're just a gravy kind of guy, you know that? I think <laughs> gravy. You're right, actually. That's right. I'm going gravy guy. I was going to make a pun, but you won at first. <laughs> so we'll see you guys back when we get our order. All right, guys. We're now back with our rather large KFC order. And I will bet there's going to be so much already that we're definitely going to have to bring these leftovers home. Mm -hmm. So this is um, Probably the, biscuits. the biscuits right here. Large recipe secret recipe fries this is probably bring it home we also got um sandwich sized coleslaw and let's open this bucket of chicken so we actually got the extra crispy chicken which is delicious so all right so this consists of drumsticks and thighs for chicken oh i haven't had kfc in a while starting with the thigh mm. Oh, good. Mm -hmm. Nice and fresh. Definitely hot. Not in the spicy mm -hmm. sense, but like, see all the juice. It's <laughs> dripping. Well, almost dripping. I'm definitely a fan of drumsticks. Mm hmm. Like the Usher Krispies ones that are five. I get KFC is my favorite. I say uh, this and um, I think the breast or the thigh. The, probably the breast is my favorite part of a uh, fried chicken. I'm not a huge fan of the wings. I pretty like everything except for the breasts. Yeah. Like, I kind of go that like. Mm hmm. 
Oh. Uh, the biscuits aren't like anything special, like anything to write at home about. But they're not bad. Yeah, a little butter taste. There's butter on it. Brisket or jam. Mm. If KSC Corporate were watching this, I asked him to add some like jam for like a side. Mm-hmm. I know they have honey pockets. <clears throat> I know that. You can see the steam mm -hmm. from your chicken. This is cooked fresh water. Oh, and by the way, I hope you guys heard, but in just a few days, within the next week, we might be doing another KFC video because we're gonna be coming up with these new plant-based, I think chicken nuggets or something. Was coming up with something plant-based. So you got like Chipotle and then um, I think McDonald's has got this new McPlant burger. I don't know if we're ever gonna bring it here. And then of course you get KFC with the nuggets, so. Cool. Mm. Mm -hmm. This is just so good. <laughs> this has got perfect amount of breading. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I love that crunch. Mm -hmm. I think it's when it's like extra crunchy, they double dip it in the, the batter or something like that. Mm -hmm. I think we use these for like ASMR more frequently than the mm -hmm. other. Definitely. But I also have some pretty good chicken sandwiches here too. Let's have one more biscuit and one more thigh, I think. I'm wrong. We got the jackpot today. Mm hmm. Now, all the places we went to. Friendly people, excellent food choices, and best of all, no coffee. Definitely no coffee. He's like, you have done with some coffee. <laughs> Definitely don't need coffee because I know he hates that. But it, what I really liked about this challenge was seeing what people out there like eating, like the varieties that they like choosing from, personalizations. So it was just really interesting to see how people ordered their food from each one of these restaurants. That's what the fun about it is, is just you're surprised by what they get. Because just like says, it's like people don't eat the exact same thing. They always like vary up the orders and stuff mm -hmm. like that. So yeah, that's what was the fun about it as well. Anyway guys, that's all the time we have for today. I hope you enjoyed this cool, fun challenge. We would love to do it again mm -hmm. in the future. I actually might do it solo not too long from now just to see how it turns out. But it was just fun to do like our very first 24 hour challenge together. I know we've been meaning to do this for a while. So big thumbs up, had a lot of fun, mm -hmm. cool unique experience and Honestly, I can't wait to do it again. And if you haven't also done so, already, be sure to click that red button down below to subscribe to the channel and hit that bell to receive notifications. And we will see you guys in the next video. This is Charles. And Krista. And we love you all so much. Signing off. Bye, Bye birdies. birdies.